All right, uh, let's try to prove the chain rule. All right, here's the statement. The derivative of f of g of x is equal to f prime of g of x times g prime of x. All right, so uh, let's start with the limit definition. Derivative of f of g of x is equal to limit as h approaches 0, f of g of x plus h minus f of g of x all over h. All right, so I'm going to multiply top and bottom by g of x plus h minus g of x, which looks like this. Then I'm going to switch the denominators. Then I'm going to distribute the limit to both quotients, right, which looks like this. All right, to make it look a little bit nicer, I'm going to make the following substitution. I'm going to let u be g of x plus h. So as h approaches 0, we can see that the u approaches g of x, right? So I'm going to replace h approaches 0 by u approaches g of x, like this. Then I'm going to replace g of x plus h by u, like that, right? Then you can see that the first limit is the definition of f prime evaluated at the g of x, right? And the second limit is the definition of g prime of x, right? So we have f prime of g of x times g prime of x, which is the right-hand side of the chain rule, right? That's it. I hope that uh, this was clear.